Okay, hello, hello, what's going on? Let's get the energy pumping, let's go, let's do it, let's do it. So this video is gonna be a little bit different than some of the videos that I've done in the past, mainly because this video is gonna make a little bit of sense, whereas those other ones don't really make quite as much sense. This video is a video that I've sort of been meaning to do for a long time, but this is sort of inspired by a YouTuber named Mitchell Davis, who made something in 2008 called 50 Things. I always thought it was a cool idea to just talk about 50 things that sort of make up you as a person. Also, I sort of realized that if anyone is watching these videos and doesn't know me personally, they don't know anything about me because most of the time I point the camera at somebody else. I'm gonna do this a little bit differently than what Mitchell Davis did because he just talked about his I'm gonna show you. So 50 things about me. Coffee, never finishing a cup of coffee. Drums, The Misfits. The Misfits were the first band that I really ever listened to that really got me into heavy music or punk music or hardcore music or metal music. I feel like that's the case with a lot of people, but the Misfits mean a lot to me. Music, Doyle. Doyle was originally one of the members and now has his own band just called Doyle. He's one of the main reasons why I became vegan and just him as a person is for some reason just really inspirational to me. Also, my backpack. Being vegan. Going vegan was honestly one of the best decisions that I ever made for me personally. Drowse. Drowse is the band that I'm in right now. We're a hardcore punk band. We're not very good. You should listen to us. We're actually really sick. This camera. This camera. That camera. These cameras. Polaroids. Tattoos. My friends. My friends are a big reason why I do most of the things I'm doing. Jimmy, Adam, Travis, Shannon, Casey, Al. Black skinny jeans, because they're like the only thing I've worn in the second half of my body for the past like 15 years. Vans for the same reason, this fanny pack. Comics! Oh shit. Specifically Saga and Deadpool. Yo, motherfucker! Did you put a Ryuk in my room? All right, so real quick break. Jimmy told me he had a surprise in room that he thought I would never found. He told me this an hour ago and I already found it. This is so fucking sick because the next thing on my list was Pops. And Ryuk is so cool because Death Note is like one of my favorite mangas. And I'm mixing light right now. This is not a good idea. My, I have no blinds on my windows. The sun's going down. All right, we gotta hurry up. Chop, chop, chop. Dragon Ball Z and Dragon Ball Super and Dragon Ball Magic. Specifically this magic card, Olivia Valderon is like one of the most fun times I've ever had playing a card game. This Olivia print signed by the artist. Also this print of Lily, also signed by the artist. This Swamp Art, Game Boys, Pokemon, Pokemon Go, YouTube because I get a lot of my entertainment from YouTube. Going to the movie theater. I don't have, I can't show you the movie theater. I just really like going to the movies. Garden State, because it's my favorite movie. Catching the Rye. <laughs> All right, so I don't have the book Catching the Rye right now because I loaned it to an ex-girlfriend and she never gave it back. But Catching the Rye is my favorite book. Peanut Butter, Crunchy, because I'm not an idiot. Final Cut, because that's what I learned to edit on. That's what I still edit on today. Stains, because almost all of my shirts for some reason have stains on them because I'm a really messy eater. Santoro's, China King. Santoro's is like my favorite place to get food in the Lehigh Valley, which is where I live. And China King is right down the street and it's the best general house to food that I've ever had. Mason jars. Man, I'm getting sweaty. Air conditioning. Nunchucks. Ow, shit. This mace, throwing stars, starting things and not finishing them because I do that all the time. David Dobrik, which is sort of weird, he's a YouTuber, but he's like the main reason why I started making videos pretty recently. Also just as another YouTuber, Mitchell Davis, because he's the reason that I'm making this video in particularly, and he was one of the first YouTube personalities that I ever watched religiously. And number 50, my parents. Focus, focus, this is my parents when they were young. Okay, so you might be wondering why the lighting is a little bit different, but after I recorded that clip, I forgot to refocus on my face. So what I was gonna say is obviously without my parents, I wouldn't be able to do anything that I'm doing today. They're one of the main inspirations to do the things that I do because they're extremely supportive. So that was 50 things about me. If you're new to watching, please subscribe. I'm not gonna beg you to do anything else. Thanks for watching.